Hey guys, welcome to SS Unitech Social this side and this is continuation of Power BI tutorial. So today we are going to discuss about the filter types in the Power BI. So in the last video we have seen about the types of filters that can be applied in the Power BI desktop reports. So today we are going to see about the filter types. So basically again we have three type of filters. First can be basic filtering. Second will be advanced filtering next will be top and filtering so we'll see one by one in the practical so go to on power bi desktop and see in the practical so this is our project by which currently we are working on so first of all let me use the column chart and try to make it bigger and here as you can see we are having this data set so this is our country name so let me drag and drop the country name in the axis and in the values let me try to drag and drop the order quantity and here you can see the countries in the x axis and the values in the y axis that looks good now go to on the filters so you can see right here so click on that if you will not see this filters option right here so don't worry go to on the view and here you can see this filter like it is selected if you will unselect this then that will not be available right here if you will select then you can see the filters now here you can see the filters on this visual first we can see the country names and second in the order quantity because we have used these two fields in our visualization now go to on the country name and here you can see the basic filtering that is the filter type one so in the basic filtering you can select one by one like australia canada france germany uk and us as you want so you can select one by one right here that is our basic filtering now go to on the advanced filtering so in the advanced filtering here you can specify the and and or condition so what it mean so here you can see the first option that is contains doesn't contains starts with doesn't start with is is not is blank is not blank so these are the options available so i am very happy to use starts with so it should be start with united so you can call this as united and here you can see apply so once we click on apply filter then it has only two countries because it is starting with the united so this is our first condition and in the second condition either you can use and or you can use all so i am going to use and after that we'll see the all now here again it should be starts with we have already used so here we can see doesn't contain so what doesn't contain states so we can see states now we can click on apply filter so now this time it is having only united kingdom because it should be started with united and doesn't contain the states so here you can see like that if we will use or condition and click on apply filter so this time we'll see all these conditions because it is saying either it should be started from united or it should not contain the states so that's why we are seeing all these values so i hope you have understand about the advanced filtering and how we can use it now go to on the top end so go to on top end and here you can see the so items so top and bottom these two options are available here you can see specify the numbers like we want top 3 top 5 like that so i am going to use top 3 and it is asking from which value you are going to calculate the top so i am going to calculate the top by using order quantity so we can drag and drop the order quantity right here and here you can also use the sum average min max count count distinct as you want so i am going to use the sum after that we can click on apply filter so it is having top three like united states then canada then united kingdom 
if we will change this as bottom and click on apply filter then it has France then Australia then Germany so this is bottom three so we can use top n as per our requirement so in this video as we have already seen like filter types first is basic filtering second is advanced filtering and next is top end filtering so guys i hope you have understand how we can use this so thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe our channel to get many more videos don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of our newly uploaded videos thank you so much see you in the next one